Chased by any predator, the only way that they can defend themselves is to run away and get in the water because they can swim very well. The predators they don't like water at all. So it's really they're going to quit on the hunt. that uh, black animals the world of beasts. Of course world of beasts are a lot more in danger in the area. You can't see quite a lot of world of bees around you know area here. The reason behind that world of bees they have a serious problem from brassing around the area. They collect few lovers on the ground on the grass actually they penetrate through the cavity of the nostrils and some of the lava they develop into maggots really once they develop into maggots inside the cavity of the of the nostrils and they're gonna creep inside getting deep deep inside to the brain which will disturb the animal when it comes to thinking or memory it doesn't have memory at all there's reason lions are getting to kill them in the area and they become in danger which means if they see the danger in five ten minutes they'll forget I've seen a danger in the area. They start to run around, getting close, and they get killed easy on that way. Of course, it's one of the species that prefer open area quite a lot. Some of the area, you still see them quite a lot around. It's really, really the preferred open spaces to live on. Yeah, well, the bees and the zebra, they're always together. If you can go wherever, in most time, they're always there together. They have a very strong symbiotic relationship all together. Also, when it comes to eating grass, the wildebees prefer low grass, zebra prefer the tops of the grass. Really, for sure, wildebees eat the low grass after the wildebees have eat the seeds on top. So that relationship is really, really makes them to come on together always wherever they go you can see the female she's got a round belly she's a lot more pregnant at this stage and zebra is one of the species too that doesn't have seasonal when it comes to breeding You can really see when the ver I mean zebra yawning, especially the stallion. You see how the set of the teeth is being structured in the front. It really uses the teeth to, to fight, fight away the others. I mean stallion if they really wants to enter to the dozen of the females here. They tend to be a lot more territorial when it comes to the females. You won't allow other stallion to get in and try to mate 
with the female that is hanging around with him. He's really, really become more, more protective with, with that. So we are, we are going to leave them here, really for sure. But try something else worst. This morning is not really, really is not a rush. We would like to try something different. I believe we've seen nice leopard uh, yesterday, but we would like to follow later on. It could be leopard cubs that we really want to see that. But at this stage, we have to go west and check around there. We might be lucky with the other animal, of course. As far as lion, we have been seeing them yesterday. We would like to try that west to follow up. Also, we want to try to see if we can see something better.